these activists came along uh, making the point that King Charles is patron of the RSPCA, as it's called, an animal welfare organisation. Uh, and they um, have a, a shored farm scheme, and the activists say those farms uh, still are cruel to animals, some of them, so they want to get rid of this assured scheme. So they're basically animal rights activists uh, accusing the king of being hypocritical, uh, overseeing an organisation which isn't protecting animal rights. So they created this um, cartoon uh, character saying there's, uh, there's cruelty on farms. And they use the uh, British characters, cartoon characters, Wallace and Gromit, for that. So it's making lots of headlines. Uh, this is the picture. Lots of people describing it as a, some sort of hellscape or him bathing in blood. But it's become a very famous photo. It's become a really big thing on social media. So they're getting lots of attention for it. It's Charles's first official portrait as king. These activists came along uh, making the point that King Charles is patron of the RSPCA, as it's called, an animal welfare organisation. Uh, and they um, have a, a shored farm scheme, and the activists say those farms uh, still are cruel to animals, some of them, so they want to get rid of this assured scheme. So they're basically animal rights activists uh, accusing the king of being hypocritical, uh, overseeing an organisation which isn't protecting animal rights. So they created this um, cartoon uh, character saying there's, uh, there's cruelty on farms. And they use the uh, British characters, cartoon characters, Wallace and Gromit for that. So it's making lots of headlines. Uh, this is the picture, Kate. Uh, you'll remember it. Lots of people describing it as a, some sort of hellscape or him bathing in blood. Environmental protesters have spray-painted one of the world's most famous prehistoric monuments. Stonehenge in England was covered in orange paint on Wednesday by two activists from the group called Just Stop Oil. Both were arrested. It comes as huge crowds are expected at the monument for the northern summer solstice. Just Stop Oil wants the UK government to phase out fossil fuels by 2030. The group also made headlines last month when protesters smashed the glass protecting the Magna Carta at the British Museum in London.